government can't afford artificial intelligence to drive the tank. Um, not that anyone's got an autonomous tank at this point, so that's that's not a huge diss on the Russians. Oh, chat, let's face it, ChatGPT chat can... It, number, number eight will soon be out, I'm sure, and yeah, uh, they'll well, be able to... It can pass a law degree and uh, do an MBA, so, um, <laughs> you know... It's... So we can get rid of all those MBAs. <laughs> all the MBAs, out. <laughs> <laughs> you're gone, you're sacked. Yeah, what, what's actually funny is that someone I, I know quite well um, has actually been using chat gpt to um write her um mba essays uh, <laughs> she doesn't just hand in the chat gpt she does I, 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 know, got, <laughs> I got i got mine from a packet of cornflakes and it's, it's done me well in the last 20 years uh yes okay let's talk um about more about this tank the the turret has what looks like when you see the victory day parade um things enormous weird cutouts in the mm. turret and it's like what are you trying to get the enemy shells to ricochet I was about to say in the, the, you got some, building some uh, shot traps into the actual turret yeah or well, they literally look like windows and it turns out that most of these weird cutouts are um there's actually sensors behind them and there's got little retractable doors when they want to use the sensors um and with an unmanned turret I guess it doesn't matter as much if you're um, putting holes in your turret. 